We got the caddy cleaned up and out here. It is looking good. I am super excited about this. Like, just yeah, thanks to Amos just for hooking me up, and he's just super cool about the whole thing. Um, so, picked this up in Kansas. If you guys saw the last video, drove it back here. I just got washed up and cleaned today. It's a 1981 Volkswagen caddy, a rabbit. Do you ask what you call it? Um, yeah, I'm super excited. It's cool to me. I've never owned a diesel, and this thing's awesome. Like, you can roll a lot of coal. So that's a lot of fun. Um, Got the VW Orlando wheels off the Mark III. Uh, we got new tires on there. These door, these door latches kind of suck. Overall, like this thing is pretty clean. Um, we're gonna be doing some work. It's missing some parts, but hey, we'll get those fixed out. Got the knob here missing, but I'm really excited about it. Let's see if I can get this quick. Okay. So look in here. So this is the 1.6 liter turbo diesel. This is the original Volkswagen TDI engine. See a little turb ski back there. It's just crazy like how simple it is. Just got the injection pump right here which has a leak so I think we're gonna end up rebuilding that. Just some really cool stuff that I'm looking forward to because like I said I've never owned a diesel so it's a lot different than what I'm used to but we're gonna have a lot of fun. It's just so simple easy to work on so be a good engine to learn on. Um, yeah, I'm not sure. I'm thinking the head gaskets might be going bad because it smoke's a little white. It's definitely burning a little bit of corn, so I'm guessing that's what it is. But hey, at least it's so simple to work on. Um, we do got some rust going on here, so you guys will see that later. We're going to address that. Most of it, the car is really solid, but this whole area here around this strut tire, you can see it's already kind of fixed up, and it's a little sketchy there. So we'll mess around with that. Um, overall, though, it got some rust, but it's not anything too hateful besides that's oh. Okay. Oh, uh, V-dub prop. We'll figure this out. <laughs> oh my word. Okay. Oh, I forgot. You pushed it. You need to push it. There we go. So you gotta figure out these old cars. Stick with your head. <laughs> the cable, the latch doesn't go back down, so you have to manually push it back down. Watch, now it's gonna work great. That's right. Hey. See, you live and you learn. Okay. <laughs> so as you can see, this is some custom paint here. You can see here, um, it had actually it used to be tan. Which, hey, this is an upgrade. The paint's really crappy, but hey, at least it's clean and it looks pretty decent. So, yeah, what we got coming up in the plans. So this thing's gonna end up back in Pennsylvania. I'd love to daily it. The front end looks good, but we're gonna get this thing lowered down here. Um, these caddies are a little bit unique what you gotta do with the axle and stuff to get it low so I'm not exactly sure how that works I'm gonna get some other wheels on here these aren't bad but like these would be good winter wheels but we're gonna get it looking good like the paint and stuff doesn't bother me too much but gotta get that stance on point so yeah just looking forward to a lot of projects coming along with this um, we're gonna get the GTI on the road too so then we'll have two mark ones so we're gonna get some awesome shots just can't wait to see them both on the road but just super super excited about it thanks for watching guys Check back in. We're going to get some more projects going on this. Catch us later for more Mark 1 fun. Oh, yeah. All the turbo noises. This is insanity. Dude, this thing is so much fun to drive. I like that this little interior here makes all the cool noises. Yeah. That's right.